Matt and AJ Post Show uh, for a Tuesday. Tuesday it is the 10th of February. We're in double digits in February. Yay. Yeah, buddy. Let's get February over with, too. All right. Um, okay, so you know, I never thought I'd be, I would be dragged into parent school drama. You, you, we heard these horror stories when we first had a child. Yeah. And once you got involved in the school system, that there are politics amongst the parents and that they, they are stupid. And I always... Stupid's an understatement. Yeah. I, I always said, look, I'm going to steer clear of the PTA. <laughs> I, I don't need that kind of sense of power. Um, but lo and behold, we were dragged into parent drama yesterday in our cutesy little white picket fence subdivision. I'm not going to describe what happened again because I described it in two different posts right below here. So just look at the video yeah. and look at the post and you'll see what happened. Yeah. But it was ridiculous. Yeah. Ridiculous. Um, so a few things about that. Uh, parents, stop. Stop that import. Okay? And don't you ever follow somebody through their subdivision, and then get out of your car and walk up to their car and start yelling. <laughs> what kind of civilized <laughs> human being does that? Well, they're not civilized. Oh my gosh! Like, talk about, you could have just shown up at my house, because he knows where we live. We live in the same subdivision. He followed me. It's not that big. It's not that big. He could have knocked on the door and solved the problem in a, a cordial, normal person way. Instead... Seriously? Apparently, Who AJ, does that? apparently, AJ doesn't know how Homo sapiens have been dealing with their problems since the dawn of man. I'm uh, so done with it. When you were a caveman, it was I have a bigger club, I smack you on head, I win. Uh, in World War One, we have the bigger bomb, uh, we win. Now, we have the smarter drone, we win. We're not good at diplomacy. Yeah, and I'd like to also thank that gentleman for teaching my child the word lunatic. Thanks. Thanks a lot, you know, because we make an effort not to call names to people. But because it's on. not okay to call people names. And then it's, you call... It's, you, listen, oh. it's a learning experience. You tell Dylan, Dylan, the man who said that word is a lunatic. No, I did not say that to him. Lunatic. No, I told him, I and he knows. I said, now, what did that guy do wrong? He said he shouldn't have yelled and he shouldn't have called names. Yes. I don't know how well that will actually stick with our son, but listen, at least at listen, the listen. But Stop some, sometimes, a little positivity can change everything. Hashtag radiate positivity, even when it's hard to do. Like yesterday, on the verge of popping a Xanax to calm myself down, took a trip to the gas station, went to buy some bread, was. Asked by the cashier if I wanted some candy bars. I said, no. She said, you'd be happier if you got them. I said, I agree, but my pants would not be happy. If you <laughs> she then talked about her husband, who apparently has grown out of his pants, and now they are all too tight. And whenever he gets into them, she and her daughter sing the tight pants song. <laughs> then we locked eyes. And we instantaneously, in the middle of a gas station service spot, started singing... Everybody's talking about my tight pants. I got my tight pants. I got my tight pants on. That's right, me and this woman randomly saying a Jimmy Fallon bit. Uh, At all the about, Speedway. All about tight pants. He came home smiling ear to ear. He's like, you'll never believe what just happened. It was so silly and ridiculous, but it made my day. So in honor of that, AJ shot a video called Mom Jeans, and that is why... I love my mom jeans. Whatever. You should Peter. subscribe to this YouTube channel because, well, she's putting that video up there, <laughs> and you will be able to watch it. Maybe. All right. So next time you're in a bad mood and everyone's against you, go to your local gas station and sing a song with the cashier. <laughs> Have a great day. Bye.